since I was in grade school. I, I, I actually knew what I was going to do when I got older, that I'd be an artist. I got started back in, in the early 90s. Of course, I had, I'd, I'd been a sign painter for years, and, and I always incorporated art in my signs. What I've been doing is smaller paintings that I have displayed here in the studio. I use it for practice so that when I get ready to do a mural, I've, I've, I've already uh, dealt with the subject maybe that I'm going to paint. I've been, been working on this for two years. And uh, in fact, when I first heard about it, I was on vacation in Utah. So I came back and started working on sketches then. Independence is a historically significant town and most people are interested in history. You start talking about the paintings because the paintings on the wall are of Kansas City history and you start talking about history and, they, and they're interested in that. The thing about painting history is, is it gives you something important that you're doing and so your paintings take on more importance. Truman was known for certain things that he did and said. I, I remember him because he was president when I was in high school. He took the country through a, uh, a difficult time. Like I said, the buck stops here. He was, he didn't mince words. He spoke his mind. We're here at the kickoff for Santa Calgon 2021, and we're using this occasion to dedicate two murals here on the Independence Square. And so it's just amazing for us to be able to celebrate a local artist with these beautiful, incredible murals and tell the story of our city and of the important people who literally changed the course of American history and world history through things that happened right here on the Independence Square.